Holy shit! Check this boat out! I'm just trying to find a way to get into it! Don't, don't, don't want to cut myself here, not anymore. Alright, cool. What? My drone's at 30%. Hope I can get some cool clips of this. Hmm. Trying to think how we're gonna get on it. Unless we can pay someone to sweep us in. Thing is, like, I want to swim it, but I have open cuts and like the water's really dirty. I'll get infected. So legit, I can't do that right now. I have to just try to see if we can get a ladder or something, or someone can help us on. Or I just can't do it. Oh, we're so, we're so. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Jolapan. Ban. Ooh. Yeah. He says we can go on. We can go on. Help! But how, <laughs> how do we get help? Go, go down, man. How do we get on? He's like giving us a whole mission, right. obstacle course. Mission. He's telling us how to get on here. Okay, go like me. Okay, bad. Okay. If you want to go on, we're gonna give him some cash. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna give him some money. How do we do it? He wants us to go around there. Oh, he's gonna help us. Yeah, he's gonna help us. <laughs> this guy, the guy who's guarding the place is gonna help us, but we have to give him money, Yo, which is, is sick. sick. So, we're doing this. I love doing abandoned places in other countries. Here, so man. fun. Go. You never know what you're gonna expect. Think we have a whole bunch of cool kids mission. with us too. Look at that. <laughs> Danny's pulling the raft over here. Oh my goodness. So he's gonna pull the raft for us to get in. <laughs> Danny, Woo! pull. Pull hard, Danny. Work your muscles. This is so epic. I didn't even expect that. Oh my goodness. Yo. Okay. I'm coming. <laughs> what? What did he say? <laughs> so I gotta pull this one. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. The kids are helping me. <laughs> yes. 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 They're helping us. Danny, We're I'm going to jump it. on. You just. Don't even jump on. <laughs> Step on the Okay. All right. The kids are all Coming over. over. Everyone's helping us. This is their extreme food. <laughs> Guys, I almost just dropped my camera right there. All right, I'm going to put my stuff in my bag. We'll get on the ship. Dude, all right, so I made it on, but this thing is really unbalanced. I don't think John should come on with us first, but the guy thinks it's safe. <laughs> oh, man. You step on that metal piece, and you step right on here. Oh, God, hold each other. Right. Me and Danny's holding each other right now. We're fucking dead. Don't jump on either. Like a Yeah, don't jump on. <laughs> We're on. <laughs> we made it! <laughs> I love these kids! Woo! Thank you guys! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Now it's time to focus on the epic boat For journey. Example, there you go. The, the end. This is what you guys want to see, right? All the fans, the good good. Oh, yeah, this here. is what we do every day. Woo! Well, if the if the opportunity comes up, you know we take it. Woo okay. <laughs> I got a bargain with them. But wow, what a journey. What? That was sick. Dude, I can't believe we made it on the boat. Dude. I've never been on, I've never been on a abandoned boat like this. This is huge. This is sick. Okay. Oh, we gotta watch when we step, by the way. A lot of this is dangerous. So get the history on this. This originally was supposed to be a floating hotel. This boat was supposed to just be a hotel on the river. It was owned by a French Cambodian guy. But stuff happened and they couldn't afford it anymore, so people took it over. And now they're trying to turn this place into the largest collaborative century dedicated to the contemporary arts. They're currently running a campaign to raise money here. This is like a GoFundMe account. I'm gonna put the link in the description below. Yo! Oh my Dude, god! This is sick. I feel like a pirate right now. We Dude, just pillaged we are, this boat. We right just now. took over the boat. Wow, this was obviously gonna be the main lobby. Damn. This would be so unique unique if they can get the money to fund this. To finish it up. I mean, they're working on it still. All the material right here to finish up this flooring. Oh God. <laughs> oh my God. 
Hey! Wow. <laughs> Jack Sparrow! Hello! They call me Jack Sparrow. Hello! Hey! <laughs> wow. This is so cool. Dude, this could be like the ghost ship. We captured the ship, Jack! <laughs> I like this so much. Oh, we gotta get up top later. Look at there's all glass panels up there. It could be cool. These were probably some of the rooms, what they look like. This would have been one room. This is how the rooms are looking, a, a basic room. These are the unforgettable adventures, the ones that, you know, you're not sure if anything's cool gonna happen or you don't even know what's gonna happen, the unplanned ones. And we didn't even know if we're gonna get on this ship. We didn't even know if there was a ship still here. And here it is. Sure enough, there is one. I'm so happy to be here, man. Thank you guys for all the support. These rooms on the second floor seem to be even bigger. I didn't know this, but when I was using my drone and I was flying, I noticed that on the other side there was a pool. We're gonna go check that out. All right. Damn. So this was gonna be the pool. Not anymore. I do admire this. I like the art on this boat. What a good way to start our intro. So right now we're heading to an old abandoned Henglei restaurant. This was the largest one at its time and probably one of the biggest and fanciest one. Usually people who eat here have some sort of, you know, decent money here in Cambodia. I haven't done abandoned place in a while. That's just because I've, there's not much in this area. So I just happened to find one, thankfully. And we're just gonna go in. I'll, show, I'll tell you more about it as we get in. So this restaurant pretty much catered to the middle and upper class Cambodians. It had a live stage, it had karaoke bar, it had four big huge buildings, as well as ponds, bridges, sculptures. It's the shiznit. The outside area had over 100 tables. It usually would fit eight to about 10 people. Over in the distance, the fish tanks are still there where the live seafood was, just sitting there, hasn't been touched. It's just dust everywhere. Everything is just looks all ancient and old. We're about to go explore this place right now. It's just all nice concrete and marble flooring. Check this out. Can you imagine how it looked like back in its prime? Check this out. This was a waterfall right here. Crossing the bridges. Hmm. I know there was private karaoke rooms. I don't know if these were it though. Seems like the last couple doors are locked. Oh, nope. Take that back. Huh. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, good. I was right. These were their uh, little mini karaoke rooms. DVD karaoke. <laughs> I don't even know what any of this says, but I know it's music and songs. So cool, though. It's so weird to see this place just dead like this. Think about how many people that were here at one point just singing away, having a good time, living the great life on vacation. 
And now, bam, it's just freaking gone. Dead. I'm about to see if I can go up there. I don't know if this is safe. I can't go back now. Whoa, it's like a secret room. Can I get the flashlight? Some of the old music CDs. All the dust. Hey. Check out her. You can just tell this hasn't been touched. Not even any fingerprints or nothing's on it. I apologize for the shaky footage. I don't have my tripod with me. I like being ninjas. Hey, we can see the river now. See? So the first thing I noticed when I got here was the duck. I didn't want to say anything until now. I wonder if he's scared of us. I think he is a little bit. He's tied up to this. Someone must have came here and is taking care of him. Unless they're going to feed him to get him fat and eat him. I don't know. Feels good to be doing a bed in there. Yeah, it's been a while. Feels good. It feels There's... like we're back at home. I know it does. <laughs> good old home. Check out all the lights and everything. They're doing some really good performances here. Look at that. Yeah, I said it closed in 2012. Look, it's even, they haven't even changed the year yet. It still says 2012 on it. Definitely an impressive stage. Dude, if you fall, if you look through this crack, you fall straight to the freaking. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> You're right, dude. <laughs> you fall far down. Have you walked on it at all? All right, so being an urban explorer, it takes not just the curiosity, but it also takes skill too. Yeah. So when you go up a structure, you want to take as many precautions as you can. So you want to go on each structural support. So right here exactly. has a structural support. On the edge has a structural support. Edge again. Edge, and when you come to here, you stay towards the wall. Yeah. Ready? We're doing it. no joke you fall down you're pretty much dead yeah down here would it, you would get really hurt be a viral <laughs> viral video josh falls down i'm assuming this is props for the stage yeah many other props too stay the, the, oh the center, yeah. is that a mask or something check the view this whole place could cave in John. You get nice VIP seats right here. I've sat in these before. You go up here, there'll be a table right here in the middle and just and it's just a bunch of chairs around it. You Probably had some big crabs in these bad boys. Really upsetting how we can't go inside this building. I'm not gonna vandalize or break anything. I'm just gonna leave it as is. Just sucks there's no door open. At least get a teaser. Look at that. Taking the cam. Taking the flashlight out. Yeah, you need a flashlight. Pretty big storage room. Yeah, it is. We got a grease gun in here that I see so far. <laughs> grease gun. Clothes. What's these? What's what? I don't know. I don't understand what they're saying. Uh, like cooking oil. Cooking oil? Kind of what it looks like. Okay, this yeah. Is a whole map of the entire city. Yep. Tons and tons of plates. Office 
So this is where all the, the paperwork and magic went down. Yeah, when they had to make it. This is where we would be, Dan uh, Danny. Hell yeah, counting money like bosses. Yep, being bosses. <laughs> Thank you.